Salutarence everyone, this is Terence here, and today we're playing a game today, and the game we are playing is called Young Souls, and judging from the name you're probably assuming it's probably a Souls-like game or something, but I assure you, but this is game is not a Souls-like game. Instead, it's actually a 2D side-scrolling beat-em-up kind of game. Similar to beat-em-ups you played in the 90s, but a lot more death. Go ahead and start a new game. Oh yeah, we're also going to try to see what the, the challenging mode is like. This is what the devs originally wanted, wanted from the game. Let me freaking turn down the volume here. Turn the volume on TV, that is. There we go. I think that's good. Go ahead. Let's see what the challenging mode is going to be like. I'm going to start on uh, save file number three. Since that's what the developers intended. Now, I bet some of you are probably wondering why are we playing a beat-em-up all of a sudden. But it's actually not all of a sudden, actually. You see, after playing this game called, uh... Lost Castle 2? 2? I was kind of curious to see if there were any other beat-em-up games out there that had the same level of depth and complexity to its combat that that game had. It turns out I found the game that's perfect. It's this one. Jen and Tristan. Okay. Uh, well, let's go ahead and look at the rest of the prologue. Didn't mean to talk over that whole scene, but I kind of want to get that out there. <laughs> I should have never dragged you into my war. Professor, forgive me. <laughs> Holy crap. No, 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 no. Children, you must run. Dorvan Goblin has come. Stop him. We need to stop him. We have to move! Right behind you! Baldwin, we're not children. I'm sick of telling you that. And this is the tutorial, folks. It's all on fire. This is just... Fuck! Oh, yep, yeah, of course. This game does have some swearing into it. Someone's going to pay for this. Since this, these guys, so our twins here are pretty much angsty teenagers, of course they're going to be swearing. Okay. Oh yeah, in the single player mode, you're pretty much uh, alternating between the two twins, but the game does have offline co-op. Okay. Yeah, I know how to do the The twins! And of course, square light attacks. Okay, slash. Ouch, that was dumb. Okay. Ow. Ow, ow, oh wow, I'm getting combo. There we go, we at least got a parry him. Do you think everyone's okay? The town looks empty. Mayor Waldo then must have done his job, right? I hope so. Alright, swap between the other twin. A.K. Okay, Jen. Uh, 
We don't want to hurt you, but we will. Uh, sure, we'll be nice. We can be nice. We don't want to hurt you, but we will. We cannot afford to surrender. Not now, not ever. We are not afraid. We will stand with the stone, and we will fall with the stone. What the heck did I mean by the stone? Okay, L2. And there's a parry for you, folks. There's also normal guard. And then, of course, dodge roll. <laughs> so far, B combat's very, very in depth. And, of course, you also charge. Do charge attacks. Ouch. <laughs> nice. Yeah, I know what rolling is. Oh. Oh, ouch. Ow. Okay. Don't take your eyes on the ball. Ouch. Ouch. I was hoping the block would work. There we go. Take that troll. <laughs> they even smell like rain. Maybe worse in the rain. I hate trolls. You hate everything. Not everything. I like being smarter than you. Ooh, you're just gonna take that? Okay. Although I kind of like how seamless the uh, cutscenes are. With the actual art style. We're doing this. Goddamn right. Walk it. <clears throat> okay. Ow. Also, I kind of hate how... How dodging and stuff is like almost like... Like, it's two separate. On, like, one side of the button, though. And that was a pre-scene right there, folks. <laughs> We'd have no way of winning that one. Oh, fuck. Are you... Are you... You... Are you okay? No, but I can still hold my sword. Good enough. Crap. So, any ideas? Nope. But I can still hold my sword. Right here with you, sis. No matter what here. I'm right here with you, sis. No matter what. Okay. A few weeks ago. So, what do you want to do today? I want... I want you to stop asking me that. I'm bored. Why is that my problem? Because I'm bored. What do you want to do? <laughs> okay, fine. I'll, I got something to do. What? Stop asking me that. Jan Tristan! Could you come... Come in here! What do you think he wants? For us to run some stupid errands, I'm sure. Come on. Oh, you can, can switch between the two like this. 
Okay. Let's take control, Tristan. Oh, God. <laughs> Gotta love when that happens. By that, I mean my phone tipping over. Okay. And look, folks. Uh, we can have free will movement around. Which is rare for beat-em-ups as well. You waste a lot of time and space on books. You know you can just get dig these digitally now, right? And you own more sneakers than any man and woman could possibly need. Sneakers are cool. So are books. Fair point. Also, I like how you're stuck on that wall. Okay. Do you just shove everything under your bed? Yeah. Oh god, me too. Okay. Upcoming aftershock. They just keep coming. Your face are probably God punishing you for letting me get bored. Or maybe the world is hicking. Hickoming. Have you ever fought? Jed, Tristan, are you on the roof again? Whatever. Let's go see what the professor wants. Okay. I may think we're pretty lucky to live in a fancy place like this. For the first few minutes, yeah, not so much anymore. What on? What even is this thing? Art. But what does it mean? I don't know. Something expensive. So you can... You can say you have it. Yeah, kind of typical. Also, move out the way, please. Okay, this is where we have to go. And that's our adoptive father. A.K.A. plot device. <laughs> Don't you two have school today? We stopped going, it's day off. Uh... Yeah, let's say it's Saturday. Isn't it first? Yeah, so that's why we're not in school. Ah, ah, yes, that makes sense. Have you eaten today? Yes, I have. I had some oatmeal. That was dinner. Oh, then maybe I haven't? Professor, you have to eat. You can call me father, even dad. It's been over a year. We know, it's just... I mean, you're not our dad, so... In your own time, in your own time. Did you need... Do you need something, Professor? Oh, yes, right, right. I'm in need of funds, these earthquakes. Suggest I need... Need to move my timetables out. Lately, the go groundwork faster. I'll need to improve the frame to allow more trips. Allow for more trips. I have placed a call. Call with the palm shot in town. I left you a cardboard box in the garage. Garage. Can you bring... Get to the pawn shop. Um, if you could... You could do that. I could focus on my work. I guess. Hey, it's something to do, right? I guess. I guess that means you didn't have that in mind, huh? Eat something. Huh? Oh, yes. All right. <laughs> Not junk food. Of course, of course. Fly through. Fly through, my chargers. Okay. Looks like this is the garage. Okay. Nice. One person's jump is another person's high valuable junk. The professor, professor sure has a lot of junk. Hey, uh, what do you think about no, you know, calling him dad?
Uh, I'm hoping this isn't one of those games where your decisions actually... actually matters or affects the game's ending. If so, I'd be a little disappointed. But since we kind of stayed with him for over a year, I think uh, it would be so bad. Maybe just something really gets angry at the idea he thinks he earned the earned that just by being nice. Guy has no concept of route. No concept of reality, you know? Tell me about it. Look at all this shit. <laughs> but yeah. I guess there are the worst things. I mean, Professor lives in his own world. He's a professor of cryptozoology. Like, what the hell does that even mean? It means he teaches bullshit <laughs> shit class where he can make everyone buy his book. The Hollow Earth War ever actually read his book nah you nope i heard it i hear it's terrible <laughs> yeah okay let's go hawk this junk cardboard box pawn shop valuables can be sold at the pawn shop give and go to town give and go in town Go see how much you can get from that box. That looks like an artifact. Uh-huh. But an artifact isn't a thing, it's a cla- But an artifact isn't a thing, it's a classification. And I classify this as an artifact. This- <laughs> Okay. Moving on. Take the bus downtown? Okay. It's those ginger freaks. I heard they skip school to sell meth. I hear they run their own gang. I hear they got expelled from school after they beat up the principal. My friend Jane says they saw him. Always knows those two are bad news. The Arcade Good presents... A game by one player, two player. Young Souls. They are indeed young. And once again, folks, this is not a Souls-like game. <laughs> Shouldn't you youngsters be in class? Oh, that's the mayor. We'll go tomorrow. I'm sure you will. I mean, as much as we kind of want to be those rebellious teenagers and such, uh, something tells us you probably shouldn't do that. And this is what the town looks like, apparently. Oh yeah, the game does have a profanity filter. Which, uh, sin but let's keep it in since the game is intended with profanity, I guess. Gameplay. Oh, okay. Also has some accessibility things here. Very quality of life stuff here. 
This is the best sneaker place in town. This is it another sneaker place? Nope, that's why it's the best. The happy fit. <laughs> gotta, gotta fit to be happy, right? Right. Never want why towns even need police stations. Not really. If it wasn't for this place, I'd probably be wrecking shit all the time. Are you saying you're the reason since towns need police stations? Basically. Uh, that's kind of creepy. They say this well has been here longer than the town. That doesn't make sense. The well can't be older than the town. That's what people say. I, mean, I know we're supposed to be kind of looking for the thing, but I'm kind of curious to see what's uh, here or not. Okay, because I can't do much there yet. Okay. You don't seem old enough to drink. I'm 37 and this is my husband. I'm 98. I have a disease where you can age backwards. Please leave. How rude. Yes, let us. Let us away. Yes, very. Let us away with our legal drinking age selves. <laughs> Okay, looks like that's the end of the line here. Uh, let's talk to this lady here. Nobody comes to my library, so I spent all day drinking at the terrace. I can confirm this. People don't read read books anymore. It's a shame. Hell, nobody reads in general. <laughs> <laughs> Sell video games. That'll fix the problem. Yes, everything is on video these days. Agreed. Eh, sometimes you want to unplug. One more of this, please. Right away, ma'am. The old bookstore in town is closed. Makes sense. Looks like a thing of past. Get over it. I like that bookstore. Okay. That's enough of that first part of the our exploration here. Hey, what do we have here? Why do people think pulling pillar on things make them classy? Doesn't it, though? I guess a little. Change, spare change. Sorry, old man. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, the cars can hit us. Okay. But we don't die from it, so that's all good. I always like this statue. Little guy holding up his sword. I'm pretty sure that's a book. What? No, it's definitely a sword. Pretty sure it's a book. Uh, let's get a closer look. I. It doesn't look flat enough to be a book. But I can kind of see see why she would think that why they it's not a fun day to be outside careful about getting old kids yep whatever you say pal let's try to avoid getting hit by a car too yep before we do that let's see what's all the way here are gray storms comforting or creepy? They can be both. Yep, whatever you say. Okay, it's about as far as we can go for the town. Really nice fleshed out place here. <laughs> okay. Do, 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 do. 
Every one of them, one of these items has a story. I need money. I'm bad with money. Life makes it so hard. Life makes it so I have no money. That's the story it tells me. Ooh, she's kind of cute. Hey, hey, my favorite horrible little punks. You got any more junk to hawk again, or are you just happy to see me? Pawn shop, son, whatever you don't want. Want that give and go. Mezzi offers money for old stuff. Yeah, she's kind of cute, actually. <laughs> yep, yeah, let's go ahead and sell you. The professor wants you to take some more of his junk. The professor has a lot of stuff, but he has very little junk. Hmm, interesting, interesting. 40 bucks? What? <clears throat> Sorry, kids. This, this is actual junk. I can't sell this and doubt the professor will want to buy it back. 40 bucks is me being generous. No way, you're trying to rip us off. Yeah, no. These glasses are made of aluminum, which is interesting. Probably from the, the white gold era, but other than making a cool costume piece. And this reader is interesting, but there's not a lot of Shakespeare. There's not a lot of Shakespeare fans in town. 40 bucks, take it or leave it. Whatever. Ugh. This just makes me... Means we'll be back with more junk tomorrow. Music to my ears. Bring something they made of gold and you'll find... Gold or you'll find... It in a grandma's house. Pleasure doing biz biz with you. Okay. Oh, hey, I almost forgot. Have you mopped here? Bright and shiny. I'll have your mop mopped here. Bright and shiny and pure. Purring like a tiger. I thought that thing was told. As if nothing could be told when it comes to the place to give and go. To press... Professor bought it last week for me to fix it up. He did? Uh, thanks. Yeah, and he said something about how teenagers need a sense of freedom to... not stifle something... being developmental. Listen. You know, some, just don't crash it again. Oh, the moped. Okay. Wow, Mezzi does a miracle. It looks brand new. I'm driving, as always. Get on moped. Oh, I was calling it moped instead of moped. <laughs> Jeez, learn to read, boy. Summon moped. Can summon a moped to go anywhere in town. And now we have a moped chat. And now we can go back home. Huh? That's weird. What's weird? Did he leave the door open when we left? I don't think so. The door looks like it's been busted. Fuck! Everything is trashed. Oh no. <sighs> Professor! We gotta find him! To his office, let's go! Okay, okay. Oh, this must be office, okay. Damn. He's not here. Professor! The basement door is open. Okay, let's see what's in our secret room. 
Should we go inside? I mean, he always told us not to. This is crazy. What do you think think this is? It's like a weird elevator. Later. Looks like it goes down deeper. I always imagined he kept a lot of weird things back here. This wasn't one of them. How do you think it works? It's like there's a control panel over there. Okay. Ooh. And we're here. And I thought the elevator thing was crazy. This was under our feet the whole time. Looks like a whole secret lab. What is he doing down here? This is crazy. Okay. We have some interesting developments here. Okay, what the hell is that? Don't tell where the professor is. Come on. Well, looks like we found the portal. Well, is that a sword? I am very much taking this. Gotta be ready for anything when there's a weird portal and swords around. Now we got our actual first weapons. All right, let's see where this leads. Jen, wait. What if crossing this for crossing this portal thing kills us? Well, no, if that's the case, pretty quick. Fuck. We'll go together. One on free. One. Let's just do it. Yeah. Ah. <laughs> We seem to be somewhere else. I'll say. Looks like an old timey village, like a, like at a Renaissance fair. Everything seems to be on fire. But the professor here is here. I hope he's okay. I would hope so too. Definitely not him. You ever seen someone purple skin before? With natural purple skin? Nope. Ha <laughs> ha. Baldwin. You old fool. The floodgates. Open and the light pours. Pours in. You speak our language? Shut up, son, scorched. Where's the professor? That old top lander? You'll find him soon enough. You will be coming with us. You will not <laughs> touch them. Touch them. You will not. Uh, whoa, uh, whoa, you're alive. Yeah, you lost a lot of blood, dude. Maybe sit down. Caw, caw. How can, how could you carry out his orders? Did you have to burn it at all? Burn it all? Those were homes, memories. The professor came in peace. We only, caw, caw. I stand for the stone. I stand with the stone. 
stone. It will be a, it will outlast us all. Children, I was trying to escape. You have to run. Run, fuck no. Why? Also, no. Why? Why should we run? They'll kill you. And you, right? Besides, if you know what a professor is, this is we're not letting them take you. Ha! Ah, you babes! Think you have a choice? How quiet! Soldats! Put us down! I want this gob goblin alive. Bring him to the Dwarven Goblin. Gob. And the redhead Sun Scorch girl S killed him. Alright, first real battle. Starts a tutorial. And we're gonna start off strong. Although, this is where we might actually die, though. Ow. Oh, careful. Stamina's a little bit slow generating, though. Oh, well. There we go. There we go. Okay. <laughs> These guys can also roll, too. Call? call? Where, is, where is he? You saved me? My wounds are bandaged. That big purple guy took off where we started tossing his men around. Something about reinforcements? As for the wounds... Professor never shuts up about first aid. A practical man, yes. Oh, oh. Or <coughs> the professor is a practical man, yet at the same time so full of dreams. Do you know where he is? Are we in danger? What are you? Too many questions. Children. <coughs> I will explain everything, I promise. But first, I need your help. We have... I mean, <coughs> no time. If you want to give me a quest, I am very well down for it. I mean, I have a sword now. Yes. <coughs> I see you're not as practical as the professor. He was never very fun of words like quest if time's still time's so important stop talking start talking you must follow the eastern trial outside the village it will lead you to a building dug in into the rocks it is our library you must reach it before <laughs> cockons men do eastern trail building in rock Thing in the rocks library. Got it. I need you to get a specific file located in the archives room. It's a green file called Secrets of the Moon Gates. This <coughs> is, a f is the file. <coughs> this file is <coughs> crucial. Yeah, for what? For proper, properly using that gate you came through. That does sound important. Or naturally. Actually. Okay, let's go. Wait. <coughs> One last thing. Here. What the crap? Travel rune. Okay. A rock? It is a travel rune. Once you find the file, squeeze it. Squeeze this. It will bring you back to me. And how does that work? I'll have this twin with me. They work as a... 
as a pair like you two. I will <coughs> return to the mansion basement. Went through the gate and close it behind so they cannot follow. And we'll catch up when we have the archive. Got it. Be safe. Oh, HP also would generate it too. Okay. Wait, how do we know this way is easy? He pointed that way. So, this is crazy day so far. Really, really crazy. You think those purple guys hurt the professor? Yeah, I think they did. Well, we're gonna... Well, glad we're gonna hurt them back. Yeah, for what it's worth. <laughs> Great saw worth one. Okay, Dwarven Goblin. We are far past Hormality's cock on stand. The village near the Forbidden Grounds have been destroyed. Most of the rabble rousers are dead or in custody. But Two other top landers. There's have a right. Young, strong willed. I assume they came looking for the professor. They dusted my men like sandstones. By the time I came back with reinforcements, they were gone. And one of Baldwin. He disappeared along with them. We searched for them. But they may have gone from... Gone to the surface. Ah. Baldwin is a dangerous goblin. Perhaps the most dangerous. He will try something sooner or later. Make sure we are ready when he does. May I request the help of Tatcha and Dinkoi. Dinkoi. In studying the gates, if we can figure out how they work. Anything you need, anything I can give. My people must be united if we are to survive the coming conflict. If we fight amongst ourselves, selves, the Sun Scorch will leave us in the dark forever. The professor also clearly understands the old technology. Yes, but he is working on something far more important. And he will be as soon as he stopped being abstained. Whatever that word says. Ah. I do not approve of Shinjo's methods. You do what needs to be done. We have little time and much to do. I will keep you no longer. No, you don't understand. You can't. Ah, please, please. I can't feel my. Oh, my God. And this guy is getting tortured while while that was going on. Okay, jeez. This is some dark shit. <laughs> Door in the rocks. Should be it. Nothing to it but to do it. I'd say so far, folks, uh, this game has been pretty interesting. Uh, can I change the controls? Customize. Uh... First of all, let's have Dash be R2 accessories one. Yeah, I think that's a lot better, actually. Wait, you have to customize them for both of these guys? Okay, geez, okay. There we go. Oh, that's so much better, actually. Uh, 
Okay. Goblin Library, answer zone. Gates are the entry points into the goblin world. Whenever you find one, it is activated by the travel rune and connected directly to the mansion cave. All right. Noise. Oh, so that means I can go back there anytime I screw up. Okay, that's good. Also, kick down doors like badasses. There are a lot of books. That's a lot of books. Who can read all these? Maybe that old purple guy from before. Decoy. The rebel library. Balin's foolish attempt to stand against the stone is now laid bare, and you children read me right to it. World. Well, I shall find the central archive first and then destroy everything inside. <clears throat> and the soldats will be here before long. I hope you, you two have a wonderful day. We only need the green folder, right? Let's see if we can grab that and get out of here. Okay. Ooh, careful. Ooh. Also, I kind of forget that stamina runs out pretty slow. There we go. Thanks for the thing. Ha ha ha. There we go, slashy. Oh, ouch. <laughs> okay. Ha <laughs> ha, Here we go, get up. Oh, for a minute. Oh, we can actually grab him, okay. There we go, nice. We're moving forward. Oh, it seems like the game doesn't have any pickups or anything. At least doesn't seem like it. Yeah, let's see if we can grab Ow! Ow, okay. Come on. Now get back here, you little bat. You little, little crap. Okay. Of course, they also have those guys. Those type of enemies. Okay. Here we go. Entering zone. Do do. Yeah, I know, game. I just figured that out. Here, have... Yeah, here, little spiders. There we go. Entering zone. We're kicking the door down. These pots don't do much damage, though. Okay. That doesn't seem too reliable, but let me go Brent break some stuff here. Alright, we're gonna play as Jen for a bit. Here we go. Nice! Okay. Ow. Oh god, okay. Ow. 
Yeah, just what I need right now. All of you to fall over. Oh! Ouch. Ow. Don't have to try to parry so much. There we go. That was dumb. That's... Okay, getting bullied too much. There we go. Also, kind of like how the like, game kind of heals you at the end of every battle. Very nice, very nice. Yeah. And I'm guessing this is all money for something. Looking forward to probably seeing what other weapons we can use. Besides our short sword and shields. Okay. They're just gonna destroy all the books. Those pure gobble. Purple gobbles are all monsters. I mean, I get it. You get it? Yeah, books are dumb. You do not get it. <laughs> yep, he clearly doesn't get it. Archive secret room. Activate these thing in the jig. So we can return here anytime. And we continue walking on. Also really like the looks of this place. To think the gates were created for that reason. Mm. Tatcha is going to be jealous when I... Who's Tatcha? She sounds like a bitch. I mean, what kind of name is Tetra? You gotta be... Be kind of a... Kind of a bitch, right? <laughs> you, my minions, didn't slow you down nearly enough. Minions? The dungeon did since. The dangerous creatures I summoned to attack you. The bat things, and I assume they just lived here. You know, with it being a cave. No, I summoned him like this. Wait, did you just... Uh, was that magic? My dark hearts are far more complicated than that word implies, but yes, that will do for now. You could do magic? That's literally crazy. Why are you so surprised? What did you think I was doing before? Throwing down a smoke bomb and running away. Yeah, that... No, I am a powerful partitioner of the Forgotten Arts. I am Dinkoi, a, the Weaver of Fates. Give us the archives, we're gonna kick your ass. Uh, well, Dinkoi, Weaver of Fates, give us that archive. Or there's gonna be trouble. And there will be trouble. Up, oh, he says, you know what? I want the smoke. We gotta give him the smoke. Okay. Ha ha ha. Harry. There we go. Oh, crap. Okay. Okay. Fireboat. Rapid fire. Oh crap, okay. Okay, good. He's down. Tired, I mean. First ball spike, by the way. So basically you just summon stuff. He summons stuff and shoots stuff, okay. 
I mean, I imagine the game won't be that. Though I kind of wish my stamina kind of came back a little faster. There we go. Fire lava bolt. Where is she at now? Ow. Okay, gotta switch. Twin switch. Oh, wow. Holy crap. Okay. Okay. Let the twin regenerate their health. Oh crap, now he's attacking while the while that's going on, okay. Oh god, oh god. Oops. Okay, this guy's pretty cool. Okay, switch. Apocalypse Firestorm! Okay, okay. Okay. Okay, okay. Chaff Guardian defeated. Whew, okay. That was fun. <laughs> First boss, by the way. You two lack scale, but you have some measure of grit. Yet you are the only two. There you are. And I am many. The archive. The rune shake it. That's my move. They stole my move. So much for... For the Master of Magic. Yeah, thanks for the trophy game. <laughs> and yes, I am playing the PS4 version, which I'm playing on my PS5. Yep, sorry for not mentioning that sooner. You know what? Let's give you a different one. Children, you made it back. <laughs> Did it go well? Are you victorious? Maybe. Haha, <laughs> yeah, maybe. We got a lot of stuff and ran into a goofball. Goofball? Dean Coy, the master... Mr. Weaver of magic. Oh. What's wrong? We whooped him. Easy. That goblin, that goblin must seem, seems like he might even be a fool, but he is dangerous. Most goblins are. They do not hesitate to <laughs> end, their lo end your lives if they can. And the powers he wield, the powers he wield are not tricks. When you face them, them somewhere out of his elements, you faced where you faced him was somewhere out of his elements, so be wary. We got this. Yeah, we got this. We need explanations now. Who are you and where's the professor? My name is Baldwin, former member of the council. I am I was helping your father with dip, with his diplomatic mission. He's not our father. Diplomatic mission? Not your father? My apologies, the way he spoke <coughs> about you and his mission. Attempting to build relations with our people and lately talked to Dwarven Goblin. Goblin. Out of his campaign against the surface. As you can see, that did not go well. 
Dwarven Goblin. But he'll hurt the professor. He will force you. It's your father. He will force the professor to help him in his war against the surface. And then he will have him executed for crimes against the stone. So what do we do? I don't know. <laughs> Let me think of it. If it. And if the morning... And if the morning I still live, we have much to discuss. Rushing into danger with no plan will help no one. As we are <coughs> safe for now, we cannot use the moon gate without a travel rune. I will compile this archive here with the professor's equipment. It may take some time in the gate. And the gate only works at night. What? That's lame. Any idea why? Something to do with phases of the moon, I believe, but I'm not sure. Hopefully, <laughs> I will have more. More for you soon. So that's it. We'll just wait until tomorrow night. So it seems. <laughs> I too have friends in grave danger. If they are still alive, so please. Yeah, yeah, I'm going to crash. Sounds good. What have I got them into? Professor, forgive me. Okay. Oh, wow, we still haven't even leveled up from all that crap. Okay. All right, well, let's sleep. While sleeping, the twins incorporate the XP they gained in, in the dungeons. XP raises the twins' level, which then raises their stats. The twins have free stats to change throughout the, their adventures. Strength, resistance, and stamina. Strength affects the amount of damage done to enemies. Resistance affects hit points, HP. Stamina allows you to perform more special actions without getting tired, rolls, dodging, sprinting. On leveling, strength and resistance are enhanced. Blends can boost each of these stats at the happy fit. Fit Jim and Tell. Please be level two. Yes. Ooh. Happy Fit Token. It gives you access to a training session at Happy Fit Sensor. Use it if you want to get, be stronger. Look, it was because he, she took forever to come back. But those soul that's meanwhile, I was the hero well, at the great risk to, to my own person. He was playing around with his magic like always. These are powers beyond your comprehensions. They're energies that make the world is what flows through me. Your ego flows for you, that's for sure. <laughs> Enough! I stand with the stone. I stand with the stone. I stand with the stone. And look at these wonderful cast of villains here, folks. I especially like that guy with the mask. Yes, yes. Yes, yes, of course. So the Toplanders escape with the Archive? They use the gates to escape, I know it. They must have a travel room. We haven't seen one in some time. A travel room? Fascinating. There were only ever a handful. Do you think they found her 
her resting place. It would make sense for it to be on the surface. The point is, Baldwin and a few Toplanders should not be our primary concern. How's the construction going? Good, a few weeks left if I'm right. And she's never wrong. Oh, Fosbor, you flatter me. Because he doesn't have any creativity of his own, he hinged his to yours. I understand the value of genius. I understand value of genius. That's you. That's what you sound like. Enough. I stand with the stone. Mumble, mumble, stone. I stand with the stone. Also, why is that other freaking goblin talking in the freaking background? That's not just standing there saying that, Grant. Continue with the construction. Shinjo. Continue to extract information from the, the professor, sir, and those who are close to Baldwin. If you find any, if you find anything, let me know. Oh, that's the guy who, that's the Shinjo guy, okay. That goblin always gives me the shivers. I stand with the stone, but his methods... This is from someone who's been known to literally raise the dead. You terminate. You reanimate a corpse would be a lot more useful than the way. than the way you use just follow tech or hum from some squad. At least he knows what loyalty is. Enough! Boy, is that literally, literally all you can say is enough? I stand with stone. I stand with stone. I'm surrounded by idiots. I'm pretty sure he was probably thinking that. Maybe. <laughs> Chapter 4. A Town of Secrets. I think we can go for another 30 minutes. Do you think the professor's okay? I don't know. He can take care of himself better than we can, at least. Very true. Want to bum around town until nightfall? Better than going crazy up here. But first, let's check out. Check on the purple goblin guy. Goblin guy. Okay. It's not the bald one, of course. I really love this uh, free roaming kind of uh, feel to its beat em up in an action RPG feel. So, what's the good news? Also, how long has this guy been coughing now? <laughs> I think. <laughs> There might be a way to save the professor, my friends, and maybe my people. Rad. We won't be able to do it alone. There are other goblins out there. There are other goblins working with me and the professor. Some of them are here in town. What? Things have been tricky politically for some time. The professor had been fine. Finding safe haven for those who are no longer safe here. Those goblins are, huh? Hiding in this small town? Did we stuff well, into a Lovecraft novel? All I know, he's made some kind of deal with your mayor. Cough. Or. <coughs> we need to talk to the mayor. 
Yeah, that'll be great. Maris. Love teenagers. The others that survived the attack, they're being held uh, in the Goblin Stone Jails. Thanks to the files you brought, I can tr connect the gate located to the jails. This will let you info. Will let you infiltrate the Goblin strongholds, even in the deep citadel where they are likely. They are likely holding the professor. So you just send this right to the professor, we bust him up. And then maybe we call the army. And the navy. The navy, they're underground, not underwater. The navy are badasses. Of course we want their help. It's not... It's not that easy, for one, <coughs> your military would likely slaughter my people. True, they are good at that. And second, the gates must be activated directly, which means you would need to, to progress, to progress gate after gate, making your way down. It would be very dangerous and your odds of survival would be, sounds good. You hit the targets, we'll hit the goblins. Wham, bam. Bam, purple skin in a can. <laughs> Doesn't make sense, but I respect the rhyme. I do it all the time. Children, this is no laughing. <laughs> Pal, you need to take some uh, medicine. Oh, dude, take it easy. Yeah, you like nearly died. This is not a game. No one is going to die. Except for those that get in their way. You are too young to have this responsibility. I should be able to. Yeah, but you can't. And we can. So, tell us what to do and we'll do it. And stay with us. We put on a brave face. But, speak for yourself. As soon as it's dark, we'll get on that. But for now, Mayor Visit, will you be, will you be okay? Hey, uh, what was your name again? Baldwin. I will be fine or I die here. I will die. I know no one on the surface that will be able to help much, much one way or the other. Gotcha. Ask the mayor. If there are any goblins that are hiding in your doctors, okay. Day's wasting, right? I guess. It's up to the mayor at City Hall. Also, we probably might be able to... To show off our fitness thing. Okay. Moped time! Okay. Leave our moped right there. And let's go ahead and use up that one pass we already have. Oh, wait. It was already in front of us, wasn't it? There you go. Ooh, she's kind of cute. Looks like you got a token. Ready to feel the burn? You want to get swell? You want to get fit? Cardio? Cross training? Flexibility? The point is you'll begin the workout. Yep, yeah, obviously. Gym training allows you to boost Jen and Tristan's stats the way you want. Choose the workout for each and try. 
and try to reach five stars to maximize gains. Come back when you get a happy fit token to raise the twin stats. Uh, jeez, okay. Honestly, I kind of want our stamina to be kind of recovering since we're going to be doing a lot of blocking and dodging. Strength would also be good, and so would resistance. So I think uh, we'll try to keep the stats kind of similar. Mash to accelerate, stay in the green zone. Come on. Yep, of course they turn leveling up into mini games. Index finger time. Damn, free. That sucked. Okay, four star. <laughs> okay. Okay, that was a decent show. Dresden, you gotta work on your stamina, buddy. Ah. <laughs> Damn, kids. Okay, let's see what you got here. Excuse me, sir, there's goblins living on the ground. And in, and in this town, you know what, Bessa? You're gonna sound crazy. You have to try. Guess we ain't gonna text secretary. Um, hello, ma'am. Yes, how can I help you? Billy, okay. You want to speak to the mayor? Yes, sure. Wait, really? Mayor Walden... Let's open the door policy. Anyone who wishes to make an appointment and can. If he's free, he wants to hear the concerns of the citizens. Wait, really? You can go right back. We can go right back. Wicked. Okay, nice. Did you have any idea the mayor was such a chill guy? I did not. Teenagers, you don't have an appointment. Who let you in here? Get out at once. That bitch... That bitch out done sent us up. Okay, uh, Mayor Guy, you need to hear us out. Barely call the police. Well then, your demands. Demands? We're not terrorists. This is coming out wrong. We just want to talk. You're the hoodlums from the bus. Goblins, we need to talk about goblins. Shit just makes us sound crazy. We really didn't think that for him. Goblins, you say? You must be the professor's kids. Melee, please cancel the call to the police. Never call them, boss. You are a treasure. So, how can I help you? Wait, you, you believe us? You actually know the professor? Yes, he teaches at the local university. I even attend his... Artful... Arthropology... B class, however you pronounce that word, once when he was still teaching. He hasn't been doing much since he has gone tender. However, while everyone else has labeled him... Him... A bit of an odd duck, I assume... 
I assure you're here about the asylum program. How can I help you kids? We're not kids. My apologies. Why don't you find symptoms? Start from the top. Billy, could you bring us some coffee? And then we let Baldwin basically... The dying came here to ask about the goblins in town. Honestly, we don't know what to do. Fascinating. So, what do we do? Hmm, I have an idea. Great. Tell us. You said the prefer so was help in the deep, deep citadel, right? We don't really know yet, but... But you think that's where he is. From what the professor has told me, the deeper you go, the more powerful the gate, more power the gate requires. Baldwin didn't mention anything about that. The professor, huh? It's the moon gate hooked up to the electrical grid. It was quite a, a howdy-do, but I manage everything thing in this town. Right, uh, so that means our grid can be can barely handle anything it taxes. It taxes the system heavily. The simply couldn't simply couldn't support the gate going that deep. There's a but, right? But called out. There are powerful artifacts from the Gulf well, well below our feet called rune stones. Some of them called runes of power are very well powerful. If you bring me those runes, I'll be able to provide you with all the power you need. And perhaps some other help. I guess that sounds good. If we find any runes of power, you'll be the first person we talk to. What about Bone? He's not doing great. And there are goblin with medic no <laughs> Medical knowledge is low. Well, I do have this. It unlocks a secret toggle. In the old well, it leads to the ancient goblin market. One of Professor's first discoveries. Well key opens the secret door to the well. Nice. A key to an old well? You might be able to find something down to help with with this Baldwin's condition. Human medicine can do little for him. I guess it's better than nothing. Let's go, Tristan. Eh, Jen practically is more of a leader. Uh, thanks, uh... Mayor Walden. My doors is always open. Come back. Come by any time. You're a bitch. I hope you have a wonderful visit with the mayor. I think she's kind of funny. <laughs> okay. You need anything, kids? Okay, sounds good. Okay, so we gotta head to our old well over here. Jump in the well. Well, key use. It works. <laughs> okay. This is mad. This is empty. So I dubbed the place Goblin Street. That's a terrible name. You drive the moped, I name places. I'm never calling it that. I'm going to call it uh, Goblin Street. It's going to, <laughs> going to stick, trust me. I'm going to guess that's supposed to be something important. She's beautiful. 
Look, Yarlanda. Ah. Oh. Whoa. That statue is... It's Yarlanda, the hero of the war between my people and yours. Also, hello, Lloyd. Didn't even say your name or anything. She believed that a weapon should only be raised to defend something important. You're a goblin? Lloyd, Master of Potions. Sorry for the mess. Yes, this place has been abandoned and for a few millennia. You don't seem too surprised to see us. I was expecting prof sir. Professor, maybe Mayor Walden, in any time now. I always wanted to meet the professor's kids. Oh boy, we have a lot to catch up on. Yeah, that is an important. Do you know Baldwin? Verily, is he around? We think he's dying and we don't know what to do. Dwarven Govern. Kakon. One the professor has been taken away and. Take this! Healing concoction. What's this? The most powerful healing concoction that I can create. It is known as a life potion. It takes you. Use the brewery. Brewery can even bring back some of the br One from the brink. It's the only one I have, but I owe Baldwin. He's the only reason I got out. You're on the run from Dwarven go Goblin as well? Yes. But all I know is how to brew potions. That one is free. Come back if you need more. More. But I'll need ingredients then. Preferably compensation. What? Lame. I will give to you, them to you at a cost. Now, uh, if his shape, his shape is as bad as you say, you should go. Uh, thanks, weird goblin dude. We'll be back. His name is Lloyd. <laughs> What do you think of the professor's children, Yarlanda? Hmm, I agree. Very young, but they have the same fire in their eyes. Okay, we can fast travel now. Okay. But that's no fun, considering that this game doesn't have a super big world. And back. Okay. We'll have uh, Jan take the lead. Oh, okay. Use the lift. Get some of this stuff here. Yep. It's just the old. Do, 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 do. There you are, buddy. Young concoction, thanks. Ah, I'm not a hunt. Not up 100%, but I do feel much better. Does that stuff work on humans? Some might speak with Lloyd about that. So, what do we do now? Using the archive you recover, I found this. Come here. The coordinates for the jail... Well, or they are keeping many who who oppose Dor Dorvengoblin. The 
but most importantly, it contains a rune of power. We will need one of those, those, t those to further reach to the moon gate. If we're to reach the moon gate, if any, any gates are already up and running, we can reach them if we have more power. That computer is linked to the portal where you at. You activate a gate with the travel room. It should, it should be added directly to the computer's data database. I already entered the coordinates. That's up the jail's gate. Use computer to connect the portal to it. Crazy. Okay. Oh, okay. We just do. Do it. Okay. Well, I did say we're going to be pretty more mint, so. So you want us to go for this ca crazy ancient teleportation technology to perform hit and run tactics on your political enemies? I know it's a lot. Cool. Mega cool. Time to lock and load. If all goes well, we'll come back with the professor. I have also, also gathered some equipment for you. It's weak and cheap, but better than nothing. Let's go over there. Oh, my name is Baldwin, young one. We'll go. Your gear is stored here, but thanks to, to the trapper room, you can access it anywhere. Try equipping yourself to get the hang of it. Okay, neat. Got your shields. Oh. Oh, you can't even use it. Okay, jeez. Okay, the shoes all. There's also some cosmetic changes, okay. And yep, very nice cosmetic changes here. Although the thing is, is that they didn't really give you much but the twins. Well, whatever. Hopefully we find some more equipment in there. Chapter 5, Jailbreak. Let's uh, keep, keep the fun coming. Okay. And come on. Ow. Ouch. Ha ha ha. Hey, Reed. 
Whoops, careful. There we go. Sl the slash. Oh, triple kill. <laughs> oh, travel a scimitar. Okay. We will take you. Okay. Oh, okay, the plus button does that. Okay. Okay. Let's try out our new sword. Fine Ruby. Okay, we will take Common Stone, Goblin, Open Rock. Ow. Oh crap, they have poison. Okay. Yep, die a little piece of crap. Okay. Oh, okay. This weapon actually has magic, okay. Many weapons allow you to perform special attacks by releasing the accumulated magic. Special attacks cause more damage and knock down even the top enemies down. Combine attacks with the direction of very into very your special attacks. Shield parry. Parry attacks allow you to stun your enemies. Gain you up here. Before a parry right when the enemy attacks you. Most attacks can be parried. Just pay attention to the timing. Strain. Your enemies may be more resistant to parrying, reducing its effect window and opportunity. Oh. <laughs> okay. Die. Pairing also seems to be back mana too. Also, this game is very action packed, so silence is to be expected. Orpal sword, okay. We will take that. And we will get the Borpal sword to Tristan. Then we'll also try out his stuff too. Yep, very nice, very nice stuff here. <laughs> Kind of glad they actually give us loot and stuff. And weapons. Oh, wow. And that's... The sword they gave me is even stronger than freaking... Their stuff. Okay. 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 Oh, careful. That 
There we go. Okay. Oh, well, that guy looks a little bit strong. Okay. Strong enough grunts. Oh god. Okay. He hits hard. He hits like a truck. Okay. Wow. Perfect victory. Lever vest, nice. Faster stamina regen, nice. Zone cleared. Uh, can I turn back, please? Well, actually, let me save. Game saved. Alright then, folks. I think now we can go ahead and end the video here. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. All that said, folks, I will see you guys uh, next video.